and not using Bing anymore. Well, sort of. I'm a big fan of Bing. I've been using Bing for probably more than 20 years, but I finally decided to switch to new Bing. I think this is the way to go after the Bing 8 updates. So now I'm using Astro Bing, which is awesome. Astro Bing is basically a very complete out of the box Neo Bing config. And in this video, we'll show you the most important features of Astro Neo Bing or Astro Bing. I don't know how to call it actually. I think this is the perfect option if you are switching from VS Code, Beam, or any other editor, or if you are just like me and don't want to spend days, weeks, months, years just configuring an editor from scratch, this video should be helpful. And remember, if you like the video, just like the video. If you just open NeoBeam without any file, you will get this nice menu with some commands you can run. And as you can see here, if you want to run any command, you have to press the space key first. So let's create a new file. I have to press space F N. And let's say we are creating a React component. So I will type colon W header.js. And as we can see, we get the JS icon here. And in the status bar, now it says JavaScript. And here at the bottom right, it says Copilot and Prettier. These are LSP clients now attached to this buffer, but we will see more of that later. If I type RFC, I get some options to autocomplete. Uh, in this case, I just want the snippet for a React functional component, so I will choose that option. And Copilot here is suggesting me to use an H1 tag, so I will accept that. The only additional plugin I've added so far is Copilot. As you may know, Copilot is basically an artificial intelligence tool that will give you code suggestions while you are coding. And Copilot initial support was only for NeoBeam, so that was another reason for me to switch to NeoBeam. AstroBeam comes with Lua Snip. With Lua Snip and Friendly Snippets, you get a huge collection of VS Code snippets that you can use in different languages like React, HTML, JavaScript, and other languages. The ones I use more frequently are the RFC, as we saw before, and there's another one, CL, which is basically to console.log something, so it's really useful for debugging. If you press the space bar, you get this nice menu with all the commands you have available. So here you can see we can command lines with a slash, open the explorer with e and there are some more commands if you see a plus sign it means there's another level of commands so if i type p i get more commands related to the packages so i can type here b for example to see the astro beam version i think this is a super useful feature it's really hard to remember all the different key bindings you have in the editor and i didn't really have something like this in my previous bin config i usually use two code formatters prettier to format javascript on save and php cs fixer to format php code also on save astro beam comes with not ls which lets you easily use pretty much any code formatter if i type type spacebar ff I get this little window and here is where I can find different files by name. It's a fuzzy finder called Telescope. I was using Ctrl-P on my previous bin config, but I think this one is way better. You can also see a preview of the files at the right. Astro Bing comes with Mason, which is a package manager that lets you easily install LSP servers. If I type column Mason, we can see all the different language servers I have. In my previous config, I was using COC, Conquer of Completion, but with NeoBeam, I don't really need any extra plugin for LSP clients. Some of the language servers I'm currently using are Emmet LS, so I can use Emmet to generate HTML. I was using Emmet Bean in my previous Bean config, but here in NeoBeam, I'm giving a try to the Emmet language server. I'm also using Tailwind CSS language server, so I can autocomplete Tailwind CSS classes. So I'm here in a React component, I can type G D to go to the this definition of the component so it will open the nav menu in a, in a new tab and I can type ctrl o to go back to the header or just move between the tabs I can get tailwind suggestions here for syntax highlighting astro Bean comes with three seater you can get syntax highlighting for pretty much any language if I type t s install info i get a list of the ones i have so far i have php javascript html typescript and others if i want to install a new parser i can type 
colon ts install space the name of the parser so in this case if i want to install astro i could basically just say yes here but i already have it for plugin management astro uses packer i was using beam plug before but i think packer is really similar and i haven't had any issues so far with packer if i type space e i get this file explorer so i can browse the files in my project astro beam comes with neo3 with neo3 you get this really nice ui with icons and git integration which is very similar to what i had before with nerdtree in my previous bin config thanks for watching if you really like astro make sure to check out this other video bye